And can you pick a winner between Andy Ruiz versus Anthony Joshua in the rematch? Yeah, and, and, uh, I think Andy Ruiz wins again. You think so? Why is that? Because he's going to have more time to train. I think that uh, he can't train the chin. And I think that uh, Andy Ruiz found a sweet spot for the shots that he was landing. And I think that he'll be able to go in there and land those same shots. And I didn't see... Uh, Unless, like, Anthony, if there's something that we don't know and Anthony Joshua was, like, badly concussed when he already went into the ring, he shouldn't have been going down from the shot. Well, I'm not going to say that, but the shots he was getting hit with were putting him down fairly easily. And Andy Ruiz knows that now, so I think he's going to be even more aggressive in the second fight. He, he, Andy Ruiz had to have some doubt going into this, the first fight. Like, uh, man, it's, it's huge, everything you're saying about him. What am I going to do? Am I going to do well? But then, now he's going in there with none of those doubts in the second fight, so it's a dangerous opponent. And Anthony Joshua's back's against the wall, so if Anthony Joshua wins this fight, he should get a lot of credit because nobody's giving him any, uh, everyone pretty much that I've seen is picking Andy Ruiz to win. So if Anthony Joshua comes in and pulls this off, people shouldn't be like, oh, he's supposed to win, you know, it's Andy Ruiz, come on, like, whatever, you know, because everyone's giving Andy Ruiz a lot of props, including myself, so. If Joshua wins, that's a legitimate, you know, he's two-time world champ, and that's a big thing for his legacy.